Abby is a second grade girl with cerebral palsy, a neurological disorder that affects her ability to develop her muscle strength and motor skills. It was her love for the outdoors that inspired an engineering design project to design and build an assistive tricycle that would truly change her life. For me, the most interesting part of this project is uh, the opportunity to give back to the community, more specifically Abby. As an engineer, we don't necessarily have as much time or freedom to volunteer as many students do on campus, so this provides a very good way for us to get out in the community. We go and visit Abby at school and help out in her classroom as much as we can, um, and it's all around just a good experience. challenges of building this tricycle were focused around making sure the tricycle was safe and stable for Abby and also making sure she'd be able to grow as with the tricycle. We also made sure the handlebars would be able to come close to her because she needs to be sitting completely upright while she uses her tricycle. SolidWorks and CAD modeling software were important tools in allowing us to successfully design and test Abby's tricycle. We were able to model Abby's legs with the frame to ensure that the trike would be a perfect fit. From the frame to the handlebar extender that was designed on our computers and much of it was even built in-house here. Um, we learned to weld, we learned to bend materials, uh, and this is all a great experience for us. for her and the seat height was adjusted correctly and we'd mock up some handlebars for her to grab. One of the issues that Abby has with her cerebral palsy is that her right hand usually is clenched in a fist and doesn't have a lot of mobility. But whenever we would bring her a prototype to test, she would reach out with both hands, open them both and firmly grasp the handlebars, move them up and down and side to side and she was just so excited to be a part of this process and it really motivated me to do the best that I can as an engineer to design this for her because I want to be able to give her that feeling and see that look on her face as much as I can. 